So quite often or not, I'm asked, would I prefer to have had everything handed to me on a plate? To be honest with you, no. Because life shouldn't ever be too easy. And for those who have been handed it on a plate, I'm, I'm not talking those who've been given a couple of thousands of pounds by mummy and daddy. I'm talking people who I've met over the years who are are very detached from society because they've been given multi-million pound companies. Um, people who perhaps have uh, done things the illegal way to fund their business or simply been handed it on the plate in terms of financial support from uh, family, estates, etc. And very often or not, the self-made individual who I see grafting each and every day um, is in more control of their destination and their goals and aspirations and feel a bit more attached with society and societal trends in, indifferent to those who aren't, who quite often or not are completely detached from the realities of the world that we live in. So if you're silver spoon fed, and you're watching this, don't hate me for saying that, but that's my reality. My reality is, is that I've grafted for everything I've got and I've worked for myself since I was a child. So 20 years on, I'm still grafting, grinding, reinvesting, and uh, a lot of the, the energy, sweat, tears, and work that's gone in comes from pure graft. And um, anyone who I've met over the years who's been handed it on the plate, well, quite often or not, they're not that satisfied because um, we live in a new world and day and age that uh, if you handed it on a plate and got it too easy where's the desire to go out and do it for yourself so I've met the spoiled kids I've met the, the spoiled adults for that matter by the way I'm doing embroidery while I'm doing this by the way um, I've met the, the spoiled adults who act like children um, and it's it but it's bizarre on how so many people in society uh would want the easy life. Now obviously we all want the easy life. Everyone wants to win the lottery, no one wants to really work. A lot of people are stuck in what what we call nine to five rat races where they don't enjoy what they do. But I'm a firm believer if you enjoy what you do, you don't really work a day in your life. Now obviously Sometimes it's hard. I have to put the hours in, I have to put the graft in, I have to do things that I don't like to do. But in the grand scheme of things, um, I do what I enjoy. And like right now, I'm detailing some products. I've got clients today. Um, I'm in my shop down, down here and obviously through the back end there. I've got my sunbed there. I've got my private studio just in the back there. Obviously, if life was all easy, where's the incentive? Where's the incentive for me to to get up in the morning and go and graft on my dream and my goal of creating different brands and estab further establishing myself in the industry that I love. Where's the, where's the incentive? The reason why I get up early in the morning and I graft all day is because like everyone else, I've got bills. And my bills, shockingly, are actually sometimes more than most people's average incomes annually. So. When I sometimes get asked, oh Gav, you've got it easy, I think to myself, mate, if you had my invoices, if you had my bills, you'd be thinking twice. So some months, I can uh, spend over 20,000 sterling cash and capital reinvestments. So it's never that easy, and, uh, and I don't want it to be. Because if it was easy, every man and their dog would be quitting their job working for themselves. But the reality is they're not. They're sticking nine to fives, hating what they do in most cases, because because uh, that's the easy life. And for those who have got it under on the plate, I've never met <laughs> so many characters over the years. And I'm not talking like the last few years. I'm talking about the last two decades, who have serious mental health issues, who have detachment issues, and have very few friends because they're in isolation because they've got it easy. There's no incentive for them going to mix in the rest of the world because mommy and daddy have given it on the plate. So yeah, if you're a self-starter and you're working for yourself and you're grafting, 
don't begrudge those who get it on the plate. Be grateful that you have them. Because you've got a reason to get out of bed in the morning. You've got a reason to go out there into the world and graft. There's a few people I follow online, and one's Gary Vaynerchuk, and he's got a really good philosophy in, in that he believes that you only need six hours to sleep. So I get out there and graft 18 hours. And pretty much I've been doing in excess of 80 hour weeks since I was a kid. So um, I don't do it to, to show off, I do it because that's me. I've got that integral part of me which says, right, get up, get on, make changes. And um, it's great to have that passion and desire. And obviously building something from scratch, from nothing, um, gives me more satisfaction than being handed on the plate. So if you're watching this vid, uh, thank you very much. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, I'll plan to do more videos and talk, talk you through my life and um, obviously I'll give hints and tips on fitness and whatnot. So again, make sure to subscribe and uh, thanks for watching.